The True King. In India, long ago, King Akbar was known as a wise and fair ruler. The king's top adviser and closest friend was a man named Birbal. Birbal was famous all over the world for being very smart. The king of Egypt had heard much about Birbal and wanted to meet him. He sent King Akbar a message. Could the great Birbal come to Egypt and meet with me? Wrote the Egyptian king. King Akbar agreed. After a long journey at sea, Birbal arrived in Egypt. He was taken to the palace. There he would meet the king. When Birbal entered, he saw not one, but five kings. They all sat on grand thrones. The five kings looked exactly the same. Which one is the real king? Birbal said to himself. Birbal knew this was a test, so Birbal looked carefully at each king. He slowly walked up to each one. Birbal could not find any differences in their royal robes or jewels. Their beards and even their sandals looked the same. Birbal stepped back and looked at the way each king was sitting. They all sat identically on their thrones. They rested their hands on their thrones in the same way. Birbal then smiled. He marched up to the king in the middle. Long live the king of Egypt! Birbal said. The king jumped up. Great Birbal, you are truly wise, said the king. How did you know that I am the real one? Birbal said that when he first walked into the palace, all five kings looked identical. But then he noticed something. Four of the kings kept looking at you, Birbal said. They copied your every move. They could not look me in the eye. But when I came to you, Birbal continued, your eyes met mine. You were calm and relaxed. The power that you hold was clear. This is how I knew you were the real king. The king of Egypt laughed loudly. Birbal's clever thinking impressed him. I hope I can find an adviser as smart as you, said the king. To show his thanks, the king gave Birbal a chest full of gold and jewels.